the main main message in this video is to really do this. Go out. Go and out and do this and really feel how amazing it is and it's relaxing me instantly. We call it light, but I think it's like energy. It's just unbelievable intelligence and it's totally equally shining on every one of us perfectly equal it doesn't give anybody more or anybody less it's just so it's just so fair mm -hmm. <laughs> hello and welcome to everybody that wants to be a better body with, with their their body or who wants to have a better body in their own body in this video we are going to talk about light and importance of light especially sunlight for your body for your well-being for your psychological health and for your for your sleeping whenever we go outside and especially after winter or during winter petra always says no take off your sunglasses for a while because the the light is then actually going into your brain because uh, the light is having certain wavelengths and certain information in there behind us is walking a doggy which it's is our doggy, Luna. <laughs> maybe we can have a little Luna. she's just walking around us while, while we are making the video i just wanted to inspire you that it's very important especially on this side uh, in, in, on your head it's very important if you close your eyes and also through your eyelids the light is coming in to your body and uh, there is also uh, which is called the third eye or somebody calls it first eye and it is connected to our sleep hormones uh, especially melatonin and also serotonin which is keeping us awake the whole day but um, when you can, can't sleep, I recommend you to do this in the morning. It's exactly when you, when you wake up, you do this. If you have a, like a, if you have a sun outside, it's perfect because it resets your system and the system knows, okay, now it's actually light outside. We are switching on the hormones, which are for the day functioning and not for the night functioning. And it's really helping you and um, then serotonin keeps your mood up and uh, keeps you away from depression and make you it energies up so you make better decisions and it's important to have it directly on your face uh, on your skin oh yeah we didn't to not that. have any window in between or, or yes any glasses it, that's that's the best and also you can wear some kind of clothing you can notice sometimes if you look uh, under the shirt the sun is actually going through. This is going on your body. It's it's good for you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's important because Rafael said uh, that I ask him sometimes to put the glasses off because the glasses are also limiting the spectrum of light coming into our brain, into our body because we have the light on and then we need uh, to give to the body clear information of what the environment is like and it's yeah. not like a red light or just limited way just for a short time of course not uh, to do it excessively because until it feels course. until it feels good yeah you know if you are crying and your eyes are crying and it's not really it's not really cool if you are if you're in the mountains and everything is white around yeah. you and the the sun is very intense then you should protect yourself of course but also, it really helps you. That's why you're sleeping better when you, when it's uh, light outside and you let the light shine on you. Not through the window, not through the car window. It doesn't give you that much benefit. So sometimes it's really cool to t go out of your car or uh, of your house and get this light, um, get this, we call it light, but I think it's like, energy it's just unbelievable intelligence and it's totally equally shining on every one of us perfectly equal it doesn't give anybody more or anybody less it's just so it's just so fair mm -hmm. you know. 
and it is also unconditional. Yeah, unconditional, and there is not. You don't even ask. Is this is this love? You know, and too much of everything can be harm, can cause harm, and normal people don't really use, don't sunbathe on the sun, and to uh, roast themselves and grill themselves there. But it's really really beneficial for you if you just have winter months now or spring is starting to inform your body hey, hey we are out of the house we are finally not in the office or somewhere but mm -hmm. we can we can and have when you when you do it consciously when you know ah this is now the time okay mm. i'm taking off my glasses just for a minute or two and y it always has stronger benefits if you do it consciously we have no idea how many uh how much energy is re-puzzling inside of us how much how many different chemical reactions are running in us in that moment and I believe that the light can be healing this way if you are not feeling well if you are having pain just go and let the light shine on you some people even go and every morning when it's golden hour in the morning and in the evening they look right into the sun mm -hmm. for few few seconds the sunrise or sunset yeah and it's stimulating i don't know it in english so sorry it's creating those exactly those hormones which we need to keep the body in balance and when the body is in balance there is no dis-ease there is only ease and flow of this energy which mm -hmm. is life which is this which we limit by saying light or life Right. Maybe you have noticed by yourself if you were driving towards the evening uh, around sun sunset time mm -hmm. that a little bit during and after sunset you just all of a sudden got really tired and then it takes a little moment until you're awake again and you can drive or you know do your stuff which you usually do at night and it's that's what happens it's creating uh, melatonin because sun is going down it's informing the brain it's time to go to sleep yes and also in the morning we have much more blue spectrum and it's not that harmful to look into your laptop and do some work towards the evening it's good to wear some glasses or just to have a red light uh, around you or whatever you could afford and and have for yourself to be better buddy with your body because the body does the work all the time the eyes can have to work 24 7 there's no pause so have a pause for them have a, like really like conscious uh, close close them and uh, restore them for a second they will be absolutely grateful and i would like to say when rafael mentioned that there is like a change of light uh, towards the evening there is a switch in our uh, there are receptors on ice some are recepting receptive to colors and some are able to see black and white and towards the night when the sun is lower and lower and lower these are switching it still allows you to see but you see black and white you can observe it also when it's really really uh, dark you see only black and white you don't see really colors like and that's that's really good for us and I recommend sometimes I switched my phone to black and white regime or I also switched my laptop or something to black and I watched black and white movie it gives you it gives your eyes rest mm -hmm. you know and so but the main main message in this video is to really do this go out go I out and do this and really feel how amazing it is and it's relaxing me instantly i just had some morning problems and i just had to calm myself down and there was light and i'm like oh my gosh thank you it's amazing it relaxed me instantly so i could have my breakfast a little bit calmer so yeah so we'll show you the view thank you very much for being with us today the view is amazing today There's still eyes on the lake the view of the doggies is weird. I have to. Looney!